Hello, hello, and welcome to Coffee Craft. I am your host, Anon Jr., and uh, here we are. Uh, I was looking, I, I know that there's a couple of people who are looking for me to work on a TNT cannon, and while I do have that in the plans, uh, I couldn't get a, a I, didn't, I didn't get a chance to do my research yesterday. I'll explain why in a little bit. So instead, I'm going to keep working on this lighting project. Because uh, if you look, we we got a lot lit up, but a lot isn't all of it. I'm now that I think about it, I'm not even sure it's most of it. Hello, medic. Hello, Arcadius. There we go. I unmuted myself. I, I was giving you an opportunity to to get your uh, your intro done while and trying to read you at the same time. Greatly appreciated. Um. Oh. I should also add, since things look a little bit different, uh, over the weekend, I updated the server to 1.16.5. We, hello, Beach Duck. We have all, so we, we are as current as we can without be, as current as we can on the stable official releases. Uh, not counting the snapshots for the upcoming 1.17. Uh, when we did that, I... Switched back to a different player Graves version because as we saw in one of Arcadius's recent live streams, the player Graves wasn't working correctly. Uh, that has been fixed. The Graves look different and have some new features. Uh, like all you got to do is right click on the Grave to retrieve your stuff. Uh, ostensibly, I have enabled uh, Grave Robbing so other people can pick up your stuff for you if you want them to. Uh, I can change that if the server decides otherwise. And, and there's a few other... There, there's some other pluses and minuses in there. It, it's all on the Vanilla Tweaks website. We were using theirs, then we switched over to the one that Voodoo Beard put together when the Vanilla Tweaks version wasn't working right. And now that this one's not... <laughs> and now that Voodoo Beards wasn't working right, we're back to Vanilla Tweaks because they're keeping up to date a little bit more current. And, yeah, uh, I need you to uh, clear a spot. I, I, I did, I did. Look, whenever whenever I stand AFK anywhere, I <laughs> the torch. Okay, let me let me Pass take this out of the torch hot spot. to you. But anytime I stand away from the keyboard, even for a couple of minutes, I do this. I grab a stack of whatever's in my inventory. I fill up all the spots because I don't know weird things ends up in your inventory that way. Why? People don't... On this server, <laughs> nobody ever <laughs> put stuff in your inventory. No, no, nobody would ever do that. Uh, I mean, only somebody who is guilty of that would be worried about other people doing it. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, can I ask you, what is that... Um, that villager thing? I don't even... I don't even. That is an Arcadius question. I'm not. This quite is an sure Arcadius question. Okay, that. since it was over closer to your mountain, I thought it was one of your things. No, nope, um, he he made it. I'm gonna hazard a guess that he's trying desperately to find the uh, archer that he's looking for. Good luck with that. <sighs> this was a once in the life in in a lifetime thing I just did. Oh. Yes, I jumped off the top of my building. Mm -hmm. My elytra did not deploy until the last second. Mm -hmm. On top of the um, uh, portal area here, which I was trying to get to anyways. Okay. And just as I landed, I landed directly in the down elevator. So I had to come back up the up elevator. Ah. Nice. Okay, so the ender chest is still at the center for purposes of the farm? Yes, right now. Okay, uh, that's now, fine. That works. I, I would like um, to you can, change that up. You can move this phantom farm, too. Well, uh, the this, phantom this... farm's fine. Okay. Uh, but I would like to... Uh, to change that floor up a little bit yeah and i was asking earlier if the ender chest 
was put there if there was a reason why it was an ender chest that was put there and not something else um the reason it is an ender chest is because i keep needing to fish a bed out of my ender chest to sleep when i sit afk and come back and it's in the middle of the night okay and i i find it excessively convenient to have ender chests everywhere you need them that's why i have a stack of 60 some odd on me because everywhere it seems like there really should be an ender chest here i've been putting an ender chest all right so if if i was to place a bed up there I does mean, the ender chest have to be in the floor the ender chest does not have to be in the floor it would be exceptionally handy to have an ender chest up there, though. No, there would there would still be an ender chest, but <laughs> I'm talking about instead of it being in the floor, I was going to make it look more like a little apartment suite up oh, there or something. Yeah, no, just uh, just so long as that square is specifically marked, so you know where to stand when you're AFK. That, Which it will be. Yeah, that that is the biggest thing. I figured since I was standing there anyway, I might as well have. Oh, that's right. I got to put those in storage. Uh, <clears throat> um, since I was going to have to stand there anyway, that was a convenient place to put it. Okay. So, yeah, move it if you want, but as long as there's an ender chest up here and that square is marked, those are okay. those are the two essentials. Will do. Um, All right, and with that being said, huh? I got a slim chunk for us. Ooh, nice. All right, with that being said, I am going to uh, remain AFK for a little bit uh, while I go get me something to eat. <laughs> yeah, I, I heard you mention that. Like, dude, you, you, you eat something. Yeah. Go, go, go get you a, a medic snack. Yep, I'll be back. Thanks for the warning. Uh, okay, yeah, so... Oh, that's right. I came... I got distracted from my distraction. Uh, so we updated the server. It's on the latest version. I updated a couple of the, the resource packs. There's a post at coffeecraft.us with links to all the most recent stuff. Uh, one really nice addition that I deeply, deeply appreciate. Uh is an update to the texture pack that adds arrows to the hoppers and all the other things that are very directionally sensitive, like the observers. And now, our droppers and dispensers have arrows that point which way the face is pointing. Which is fantastic. Uh, putting a hole in the floor is not fantastic, though. There we go. Nothing ever happened. Um, so you get some very convenient, very nice arrows that, that show which direction your redstone is pointing. Because uh, there is nothing more frustrating than looking at the side of that and not knowing where. Oh, that's my own fault. Okay. Then where did the uh, item frame go? And oh, uh, that's even worse. ever happened. 
So anyway, we got we got a couple of minor updates to uh, to those textures, and I found a couple others that I wanted to try out before I checked with the rest of the server to see if they wanted them. And the most readily observable one is ones that makes the uh, leaf blocks look just a tad more leafy. It gives a little more uh, flush to the foliage. Nothing, nothing too obtrusive, nothing too different from stock. Uh, just a little, a little bit more, uh, a little bit more fluffy. And I, I, honestly, I don't know how I feel about them. I like the look of them, but I don't know if it's drifting too far from our server ethos of keeping as close to vanilla as possible. So while we got data packs that do things like the player graves and a couple of crafting recipes and that sort of stuff, we, we've worked very hard to make sure that when we add a texture pack, when we add a data pack, we keep things so that way they are as true to vanilla Minecraft as possible. There's nothing weirdly outrageous like a jetpack or, you know, uh, I don't know, you know, uh, let me have a sip of coffee. Maybe, maybe I'll be able to explain it in a second. Okay. <laughs> uh, everything that we have done enhances vanilla Minecraft. It doesn't drift exceptionally far from it. Even though there, there's some that I would love to do. Like there, there's one that uh, lets you lets you set a place as home. And then you can use a special compass, kind of like the, the Hearthstone in uh, WoW and various other MMO type games. Uh, and, and so you'll be able to teleport back to home once every so many in-game minutes. Uh, yeah, that kind of stuff. It's cool, it's fun, it looks good, but it's not true to vanilla Minecraft, so we don't do that kind of stuff. Uh... And the other one that I'm testing out because I wanted to see how it looked. I'll probably separate it into a different resource pack. It shows the power level on the redstone dots. Because Rayest and I plan on doing a redstone tutorial series at some particular juncture. When? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, both of our time is uh, uh, limited. Uh, that's the easiest way to put it. So, you know, that redstone dot is putting out a power output of 15. If you look over in there, you'll see that's putting out a power output of zero. Um, and then as, as stuff gets turned on and off, it will... It'll... Uh, It'll show you that as well. But anyway, I came down here to, um, that's going to cause nothing but problems, isn't it? Huh. There we go. That'll work. Because I wanted to turn on the lights and leave them on for a second. Because we've done this whole, fr everything. Okay, not everything. We got to get this corner here. <laughs> I'll probably get this corner here up to the end there, and that will finish up all the lighting in the front of the community center. We got this road that goes back here by the chapel and the iron farm. I still need to do the roof on that. I got an idea that I do want to try out before I start going full hog on that project. Um, this back a little bit, uh, if I remember right, we got all the area around the sheep farm. <laughs> I probably also need to do a survey of the sheep real quick, make sure everybody's still there. For some reason, these guys are not well protected enough from lightning strikes, so we occasionally find... Um, some cooked mutton in place of wool. Makes life interesting. Yeah, so everybody's there. Good. 
and it was everything down this path and around and, and in that back area there that we have yet to light up. What I'm thinking of doing is I'm going to run this power all the way down to this wooden walkway here. And instead of trying to tunnel under this feature and run power across the water, which is never a good idea, uh, I'll just run that side down to that side of the bridge and then pick up the power from this path to run down here to that side of the bridge to this bridge. I forgot about these lights here. Uh, in the grand tradition of engineers everywhere, I will save that for a future problem and <laughs> instead work out the rest of these lights over here and on and on because some genius told Rayast if she made all the lamps and put them down, they would light them up. Somebody needs to rethink issuing challenges to Rayast. And I know better. I know better. Also, 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 uh, ooh, where's, uh, where's the redstone box? I think I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna have to turn off the, I, I've been trying to play with sliders, default shaders again. Uh, who do you think Beach Duck? I said, because I didn't think she would do it, that if she crafted all the lamps and put them in the ground, I would light them. <coughs> Someone should know better than to do something like that. <laughs> I tried to tell you at the time that you needed to be quiet. Uh, well, I also heard I also heard a medic say something about if Reyes would do something, then he would do something. And I'm just saying, you know, I, I don't think he realizes what he just did. Well, to be realistic. Although that also makes two people on the server now who have told her that if she made the Wither Skeleton Farm, they would start farming withers. Or farming, uh... Yeah, withers. Not the butler withers. No, uh, withers is in the three-headed Kerberos type critters. I still got a... I got a sizable to-do list. And not just on the server, either. Uh, if you are subscribed to my YouTube channel, and if you're not, why aren't you? No. Uh, if you're subscribed <laughs> to my YouTube channel, you've probably noticed that... Uh, oh, I was going to turn off shaders. Um, video. Shaders. Um, <clears throat> I posted a little seven-minute video announcing that I have officially entered... Great Guitar Build-Off 2021. So I filled out the form. I paid my fees. I am now an official entrant into the Great Guitar Build-Off 2021. That means that uh, I need to get cracking. I'm putting together a guitar. Uh, I'm entering, there, there's a couple of different uh, guitar building questions. Oh, guitar building questions. Seriously? I, ah, uh, my brain. Where did it go? Um, there's a couple of different uh, guitar building competitions in the Great Guitar Build-Off. There is the kit building competition which is the part that I have entered in. So you take a guitar kit from somewhere like the Fretwire or um, Bargain Musician or um, any of a variety of places. 
What did I get? What did I, what did I open that up for? I knew I was missing. Oh, uh, stone, chiseled stone. Yikes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that does not bode well for whatever guitar I build. Okay. <clears throat> If I were asked, where would I put the chiseled stone? Anyway, so you got the the kit building contest. You've got the invitational, which is what last year's Great Guitar Build Off was. Uh, basically, it's been inviting a select group of luthiers and woodworkers to uh, to build some guitars. Or just to make some sawdust. Depends on uh, who you ask and how you ask. Uh, did I bring? No. Are you kidding me? So, that, the, what was the original competition is now the Invitational. Uh, as the name would imply, you have to be invited. Uh, winners of previous competitions get invited back again. So, as far as I know, most of the people... Well, nothing's been officially announced. So, uh, I know the winner of the unofficial competition from last year is definitely in the Invitational this year. I believe the winner from at least one of the competitions this year will be invited to the Invitational next year. Uh, that part hasn't been fine-tuned so much. So there's the Invitational, the kit building, and last but not least is the Scratch Build competition. It is pretty much what it sounds like. You, uh, you start with a, a guitar body, and you car <laughs> you start with a chunk of wood. You carve away anything that's not a guitar, and uh, submit what's left. <laughs> I know it, it makes that sound so simple, and yet not so much. All right. what, am I, what am I even doing? Well, they never know. I'm trying to do some lighting. Last gonna have to go there. But, uh, I'm going to try. I'm going to try and uh, and get a couple of practice kits built before I, I get my proper uh, great guitar build off build put together. I've got a uh, Tele Deluxe kit in a box behind me that I will be putting together and selling once I'm done in the hopes that I will be able to. Uh, make it so good that I can earn enough money to buy a better quality kit for a second go round. And then if I'm supremely lucky, I'll be able to manage that yet one more time and get a really, really nice kit for the actual competition. That's my goal. Uh, whether or not I achieve that that's that's going to be the question. And especially whether or not somebody will pay for those first two <laughs> kits once I get done building them. We'll see how those turn out. Uh, I've got a couple of ideas of what I want to do for the Tele kit right behind me. But I don't know that I'm going to be able to do anything with it on uh, just just yet um, and I find that I'm struggling harder than I should with the redstone in front of me I apologize 
I've also lost track of where where the road is. Uh, all right, let me light up to here and then figure out where this is up there. So I've got that guitar kit building that uh, is going to be occupying my attention for a little bit. I've got weird corner to traverse. Stone there. And I can do that there. That should power that dot, which powers both of those. And let's just continue around the corner. Let's check that before I go too much further. Because uh, I definitely, definitely, definitely don't want to uh, to mess that one up. Alright, so if I power that, like it's daylight, and all the lights need to go off. Those foxes make some weird noises too. There we go. Alright, that's working exactly like it should. Because basically the power is working down, powering that block, because that block is powered, it is powering that redstone dot, which is powering those two repeaters, and continuing everything down the way. Yes. Okay. Okay. So I've got a bunch of stuff with the guitar build off that I need to put together. I've got more server stuff that I need to get done. I did get the uh, villager voice data pack updated. Um, the one that has uh, <laughs> the one that has all these guys going. How you do? Hello. How you do? Yes, that is updated. So the data pack is now compatible with 1.16.2 through 1.16.5. Uh, that that was an actual concern. That uh, long story short, yada yada yada. The way data packs are set up, you you get to update something in them. Even though everything technically works with newer versions of Minecraft, then when I initially built the data pack, uh, I needed to increment one number from five to six, and it magically works again. That's the <laughs> that's the way it goes sometimes. So the villager voice data pack is updated. I went through all the fun of republishing that. Uh, right before updating the server because I realized that I needed to update that to update the server. Uh, <clears throat> it's raining again? When did, when did we move to Seattle? Alright. What I really need to do... Just ramble off a bunch of the other things that I needed to do. In the hopes that I, I, I can go back later and uh, derive some useful notes. But I don't think that's going to happen. Alright, that's going to light those guys. Oh, um, mm. 
I don't like all these redstone dots I'm having to put down, but that, uh, I guess that's the way the path ambles. Is that the proper, is that the way, is that the best way to say that? I don't think that's the best way to say that. But, uh, it might have to be. That lights those. These and those and those and those. There's your dots and... There's something else I needed to mention. There's a bunch of somethings else I was supposed to mention. where I need the torch to be. That'll be the last one. Oh. Oh. Okay. 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 I can put that there. And that there. And then do that there. Yeah, that should do it. Hooray for not overthinking, overthinking it for a change. I mean, I guess I technically don't need the totem. Or if I do need the totem, I got other problems going on right now. Alright. What you doing? I am working on a lighting project that was foolishly, foolishly, foolishly promised to someone. Oh, okay. What's everyone else doing? Uh, Medic went to go get food because he heard that that was slightly important. And Generally, yes. I don't know where Arcadius is. I lost track of him somewhere. I didn't realize it was my turn. We are on the latest release, yes? Yes, we are on the latest release. All the data packs have been updated. Uh, I still don't have the updated... Uh, dude, in the trading hall. <laughs> Gem Trader. Yeah, my brain today. I, I think it broke when... Which instrument was it? There was... Beach duck. There was a guy. Continue. Th there was a, a violin. And I pull off the rack, put it on my workbench, and I see that somebody put a giant red sticky note and wrote broken across it. Like... It's not red, it was purple. Well, thank you. Thank you for... Thank you for that. I'm not sure I would have known it was broken if you didn't say it was broken. Because when I opened up the case, I found a peg box in multiple pieces. And various assortments of uh, <laughs> the, uh, the uh, what was the instrument scattered hither and yon throughout the case. Uh, um... Um... What happened to the snowman? What snowman? What snowman? The beheaded snowman. What snowman? We didn't have a snowman. Would you like to build a snowman? Look, it's Frosty. He just doesn't have a set. He'll be back next winter. 
Actually, I'm kind of curious if... Uh... Your words I can't say. Oh. I was over at the trading hall. Oh my. Oh my, my, my. Oh, hey. Rest is going to want to talk to you guys. You're looking at your workstation. I need to put another one of these guys in the next room over. Uh, I got to find out why. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I bet that's exactly it. Because I got to double check. Did, uh. Yes. But why is Medic a girl? Because his default profile is the slim one. When when you're when you're setting your skin, it just gives you the traditional and the slim as your two options. The traditional is Steve and Alex is the slim. Um, FYI, we have three full stacks of shulkers now. Okay. That's a lot. Um, it's because Medic changed his name. That's why. These are all for a Medic art FRCG, not an ex-Medic frog. Oh. So I'll need to I'll need to update this guy. Uh, somebody, please, like, remind me tomorrow or Thursday to... Uh, why don't you write it down? Uh... Is I cleaned up my notebooks and put them somewhere. So I'll need to update this guy. Medic! We figured uh. out your life. Yeah. What? Um, we figured out your life. Because you changed your Minecraft name. I, I, I thought, I for some reason, I thought this was based off of the UUID. So that shouldn't change when your name changes, but no. It's uh, it's because your name changed. So that's for the skin for a medic FRCG that doesn't exist anymore. So, so... I gotta I gotta update this guy and make his twin with new style gems. Because these are the old gem textures for the player gems texture pack. And I don't Oh, because I needed that to put a placeholder. Um. If you look at our recent end loot, and the end loot that uh, Arcadius did on his own live stream, unless Reyes, oh, Reyes just putting them away. I've been putting away, yeah. Okay. If I were to re-ask, where would I put the gems? It's in the thing. Yeah, so you see, those are the old style sapphires, these are the new style sapphires, and so on and so forth for all the other gems. So these guys are the new ones, those guys are the old ones, and there really is only five? I thought there was more than five. There are only five, it's annoying. Why is it annoying? I thought you liked odd things. I do like odd things, but it doesn't fit any of our storage <laughs> slots and it's yeah we're not talking about it it hurts my soul okay oh but look at this one look at this one look at this one which one's this one the one i'm opening yeah yeah we, we get a few shulker shells they'll last us a little while we'll, we'll probably do another run before the season's out so there's nothing I need to do to fix the head? Uh, I, in this one. To the best of my knowledge, there's nothing that you can do to fix the head. Because it is okay. looking... I don't think it is looking his for his face like that with him in the room. It, 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 it is... It's kind of mean. It's looking for a player that doesn't exist anymore. Like, if okay. somebody were to go get uh, Medic FRCG... It'll probably change it to their skin. I really thought ah, that okay. I really thought that it went by the universal ID number, not the handle that you used. 
So you don't know all the things. Well, so many other, like the server permissions go by the universal ID. And so many other things in the game no, go by saying, the universal if you don't ID. Know all, like, why is this one all of the things, still right? Then that means the... You, the why, why is this one still right and the down. other one's wrong? Because we haven't taken it down. We haven't moved it. Uh, and it hasn't had a chance to look for an update. Okay. That makes sense. Uh-oh. Which is why this one has the wrong beard. <laughs> I don't like uh-ohs. <laughs> what, what, uh -oh. What's the uh-oh? You, you were just over by Redstone and said uh-oh. Don't... Don't make me admin teleport over to you. Where are you and what's the auto? Silence. Uh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What, what just happened? I don't know, but I don't like it. Yeah, I don't... Oh, unless something got... I hope nothing got spilled. That's a big uh-oh. Just keep following the path. Huh? There there might have been a creeper. Oh. Okay, oh. Where, where was the creeper? Near the redstone. Near which redstone? Fortunately, the part you hadn't lit up yet. Uh, please tell me you are working on helping to dig some of that out, right? Well, I was actually putting stuff away before I did that, but... Ah. What, is it down here? And I came over here to put away the horse's armor, and I walked over here... Mm -hmm. And I walked around here to get around the bushes of death, and then I walked over here. Oh. I see the problem. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> I, I, I expect... Look, the way you said uh-oh, I expected something much bigger than that. Like, like I expected you were over in the storage or the trading hall or <laughs> like, like something super horrible. I, I, that's, that ain't nothing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, he said it. Oh, um, since you're also watching the stream as a moderator. Uh, and you weren't here for the earlier part. I added a I borrowed a couple of updated textures from Vanilla Tweaks. What, what do you think of the bushier eh? trees? Eh? Meh? No? I don't. They don't look bushy on my screen. No, not on your screen. On my screen. I added it to my personal. I didn't add oh. it to the server resource pack. I added directional dispensers oh. to the server resource pack. No. 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 You don't like those? No. 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 I am going to guess she doesn't like it. Okay, so they'll be on the uh, server in the next update. No. <laughs> Why do you not like them? Uglier. Uglier how? They look like someone's poorly kept beard. Hey. Um. Hey. <laughs> <clears throat> what was I don't care which of the three of you chooses to take that <laughs> offensively. <laughs> what? Wait. Why do you say the three? Arcadius keeps his fairly well shaved because I don't think you'll let him do otherwise. The abrasions on my face say otherwise, sir. <laughs> oh. Oh, that is dug out. Okay. Oh. 
That's what in part. Is. It's an adjacent dugout. An adjacent dugout? Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. I I heard the sizzle of uh the Umla is dying, and I thought for a second that a creeper had spawned. Because all I heard was tss. Uh, where's Arcadius? At his computer? Oh, was Arcadius, that not the question? Arcadius, why are you not playing and talking? Because originally I was going to get up and get something for dinner. <laughs> I keep telling myself over and over again, uh, just this one extra row. Just this one extra row. Uh... <laughs> I've been one extra rowing it for like an hour. <laughs> you, you should... Actually, an hour and a half, technically. <laughs> you, 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 should, you should really go get something to eat then. I hear that's healthy. There's even a consensus that it's healthy. You want me to go make you some sploosh? There's some really tasty chicken left over, too. Here, you come dig for a non, and I'll go make you sploosh. I'm digging for a non. You're also digging out the lighting tunnel? Oh. I hear the sounds of silence. Jumpy guys. Two, three. Huh? The what guys? The, the jumpy guys. The slime guys. There you go. Slime. Oh. <laughs> Where is the slime chunk? Come help dig out lighting so I've things stop like eating my four, face. Maybe even five chunks down here. Just on the other side of the present. You should see the beacon. Being... Oh, okay. I, I caught uh, half a sight of green and, and got a little worried that something... Wait, what did you... Are you raising this, or...? No. Okay, well, I'm just trying to figure out why you dug up the path. What did the path ever I do? I got tired of trying to look around it. I'm just going to go get grass and put it back. <laughs> 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 wow. Okay. Although I do think we need to go one lower. But yeah, I got fed up with trying to work around, like, look, where look, am look, I at? Uh, uh, I can't uh, see where I'm at. Hang mm -hmm. on. Stop right there. If you are going to change the elevation of any of this path right here, you go do that now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I wasn't trying to change the elevation. I just got I tired while I'm digging trying to figure out where the path is. If you need this path different, make it different now. Because when I go like this Is it up, easier if it's all the same height? Uh, not too much one way or the other. I just well, don't no, want to come through here and do this and here. Anyway. Oh yeah, I need to make a bridge. So go go make your bridge. No, the bridge is going over here. I don't know what I want to do for a bridge yet. And I can't really tell where I need to make the bridge because somebody hasn't finished a certain farm. Yeah, we, we weren't talking about that. That's on the to-do list that I need to oh, write down. Weren't me? Okay, cool. Um, uh. So anyway, I was just going to do this, well, you, and you know, instead you know of arguing with it, just gonna put be. grass the opening's blocks. Gonna, the opening's going to be where the staircase comes down. That That is the entrance to yeah, the farm. Yeah, so i got to figure out how to get from here to there, and I haven't figured that out yet. I can't figure out how to get from here to there either. No, oh, we were talking about different things, weren't we? Mm -hmm. How come the lights are always on? Because I turned them <laughs> always on, so I knew where I had finished Oh, that's and a good And to make reason. sure that they worked. It's also a good reason. Since they're always on, we don't need these torches anymore, do we? Uh, they're not going to always, always be on. Yeah, but I have torches in the middle of the road that look kind of busted. Oh, yeah. Um, good. Get rid of them. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? How do I get out now? 
Do you get out or what? I'm stuck inside. Well, I mean, we all are. It's a pandemic. That's not funny. No, it's not funny. <laughs> Which stuck inside are you referring to? It's okay. I'm just going to bust a hole. Oh. Well, I mean, if you're going to do that, I've been meaning to bust a hole in on this side anyway. In which side? No, uh, over into <laughs> over into our armory. Because uh, I, I needed to find a another access point into uh, the utility tunnel. So I was thinking well, don't about put the hole there. <laughs> this is look. This is where the path finishes. So I'm gonna reiterate. That's a horrible place for the hole. Okay, so. Figure out where you want to put it. Besides, I was going to try to make a redstone door that sat beside behind the uh, Rhea statue. So you hit a button and these two kelp blocks got moved out of the way and let you into the How utility tunnel. How much is tunnel. sleepy? I mean, I really should sleepy because I, I can't string two thoughts together for nothing today. That's, why, that's part of why I wanted to pick a project that was a little more zen. Like, I really would like to finish the tree farm. I really would like to build that TNT cannon. I really would like to build a lot of stuff. But uh, my mental prowess is... Behind Reyes is acceptable. But why don't we all go play Catan? I thought we were going to do that too, but I was also going to let Medic eat first. Since uh, that, that seems to be more than marginally important. You're too nice. Anyway, as long as it's a one by behind Reyes, that is acceptable. <laughs> Seriously. Someone sleep, someone sleep, someone sleep. Things eat face. I did. It's 6 a.m. And yet the face eating commences. Yes, because once they're here, they don't just magically disappear, especially if they have a helmet on. How far, how many blocks below the top does it need to be? Does what need to be? Your, your place of stuff. Oh, you really are just knocking all this out. Um, I don't know. Cause yeah. I, I, well, I, I also needed the path One, to help out. Okay. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm not pretty, pretty, pretty yet. much you see what I'm doing here. You, you should actually One, be able to two. do some of it. And this path, this path, I'm just mm -hmm. going up to the bridge. I'll light the other side of the bridge from a different direction. Okay. So this is going to dead end at the water. I, I ain't dealing with that. Not even a little bit. Same I am. You don't want a redstone and water? I don't want a redstone and water, Sam I am. Medic, are you done eating yet? Mm hmm. Arcadius, if you're going to eat, speak now. Arcadius, you should go eat. Alright, I'm going to go make him food to put it in his face. Somebody okay. help dig. Alright, so you are doing things with that <coughs> passage, so that's as far as I'm going to light in that direction. Uh, let me go... Let me go back. Back to where I just was. No, let me go, uh... in a different place. Yeah, I, I do like keeping this open as a utility tunnel, though. I, I'd like to start putting, in, like... Uh a little utility entrance by each of the areas this path goes by. Like, we've got this little utility entrance over here. Oh, somebody put my safety fence down. Uh, so, get some way up here from down there. Because that's where that's where the uh, farms are going to end up going. That feed. Oh yeah, I did leave those there. That's where my redstone stuff went. And my lighting box. Okay. 
All right. It's fine. It's fine. But anyway, where all these crop farms are going to go, they're going to get... Uh, I'm going to put a couple over on this side, a couple over on that side. I haven't figured out how I'm going to fill them into this tunnel. And what, I, what I'm actually thinking, possibly, is... Well, A, I'm thinking that I might have overcomplicated it just slightly. Um, nah. I know. I know. It's so hard to believe. And I really just need to be moving those three farms this way and sort. And that gives me more vertical space to work with. And then do those get three guys that way. Because the problem I'm running into is... There's part of the portal. There's the path. I don't have an up to go there because that's all part of the farm. Um. So. Safety fences for the win. Speaking of eating. I wish I could keep a pork chop handy for whenever I felt like eating one. Uh, so chilling in your bag? Yeah, yeah, you know, just have a pork chop already ready. And still, you know, edible. When you consider how long I've been carrying around those pork chops. Isn't that what jerky is? Um, You know, now that you put it like that, I hadn't really thought of it that way. But I mean, you're not wrong. I know. I'm just glad you said it. Seriously. You put it in the universe. That's not my fault. <sighs> Alright. And, oh. You weren't here when I pointed this out. But, um... On my screen, not on the server, I've got it set up so the redstone will actually show you the power levels that it's at for when we start recording our redstone tutorials. How you do that? What? This? Yeah. It's a uh, resource pack. How? Oh. You install the resource pack. You're not funny. I, well, you know, I think I am. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, y you would install it just like you would any other resource pack, which should probably be a tutorial in and of itself. <laughs> yeah, if only we knew a person who did those. Yeah. Well, especially since I got the villager voice resource pack and and I simply kind of hand wavy go yes you install it just like you do any other resource pack oh so you were like literally that person that we complained about mm -hmm. okay yep but I know it's horrible <laughs> I I hear that makes all the difference And if you believe that, I think I've got some stocks in the bridge to, sh to sell you. No, no, sorry. I've got some uh, game GameStop stocks to sell you. That's adorable. <laughs> Have you been keeping track of any of that? Mm, only tangentially. Okay. That. Yeah. I'm not going to. Look, if I can't even explain what I updated on stream in a coherent manner, uh, I ain't going to make that clear at all. So uh, I'll save that for another day. Okay. Well, you and finish doing that. I will be right back as I go make Arcadia's food. Sounds like a plan. And get more coffee. That's always advisable. Uh, okay. Yeah, 
this is about my speed today. Uh, although, I don't know. I might, I might go get a couple of those farms started, even though... Even though I don't have the collection system in place, just so that way we can start uh, getting a little food out of them. What I was thinking of doing are a couple of micro farms instead of instead of something really big and you know uh, space consuming and time consuming and difficult to figure out how to collect. Because the other thing is, I'm not sure. I'm not sure just how many carrots and potatoes and wheat and whatnot we need. I know we need the we I know we need carrots by the bushel when we go to get more villagers. But we're not getting more villagers all the time. So it's one of those I don't I don't know how often we need that kind of kind of things. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. So I'm thinking uh, of treating it kind of like we did the sheep farm, where while it's not rapidly producing, it's always running in the background. So there's a lot there when you need it, and just don't expect immediate replenishment. And just running it like that, so instead of a massive and massively uh, overproductive farm, it's just uh, just enough, just enough for when you need it. Right, redstone line is gonna go that way. And we're gonna go one, two, three. How many blocks does it take to get to the sun? No. Uh, Kids ask your parents. <laughs> that was the other thing. Uh, I I still need to figure out how I'm going to record the guitar building videos. Uh, I need to clean up that hot mess over my shoulder there. So I'll have the space available to record my guitar videos. And uh, I'm going. The only the only lavalier mic I have is a um, oh how to put it a price conscious Radio Shack lavalier mic. I mean, I work for a company with a rather impressive employee discount on lavalier mics, but my problem is. I can buy the mic or I can buy the tools. I, I can't I can't manage both. So it's uh Yeah, do do I do I buy the mic or do I uh why am I getting I'm getting a little worried, running into a lot of cobblestone. So I uh, I'll see what kind of audio I can squeeze out of this discount mic. Or a phone. And then, uh, and then go from there. I must be over by the trading hall. There's a lot of people asking how I'm doing. something else. There was something else that I wanted to make sure I brought up on stream. I know there was a couple of things that I asked uh, in other places for people to remind me. So what? Lanes on a highway? Oh no, I want you to be here for that one. That's not a good sound.
I hear you. That's not what I wanted. Uh, does anybody else know about a zombie problem down here? Where is down here? <clears throat> Somewhere around the villager trading hall. Or is it... Oh, no, it's nighttime. Never mind. Here, I'm trying to dig around for zombies. It's nighttime, and nobody's slept. Of course there's zombies around. It's not lit up. That's kind of the point of the project I'm working on. To light things up. Why? Because there's zombies. I thought you said you needed <laughs> to sleep. Uh, yeah, I need to sleep. Oh, or are you talking about in-game? I'm talking about IRL. Because, uh... I did, I did, I got to sleep very late last night. I'm, so trying to, I'm trying to remember what, what the big deal was last night. I know... Oh, because of a series of unfortunate events all kind of cascading down. Uh, I went to bed very late Sunday night because I was working on the server update and the data packs and that kind of stuff. Which meant that I got up late on Monday and got to work late on Monday. Which meant I left work late on Monday. And, uh... And then I got to the grocery store late. Uh, the people at the grocery store were extra special. Complete with their very special understanding of what six feet is. And what one, one direction is. Or one way only, this way only means... Um, very special. Very, very special. So, I started to get home late, and I've got a trunk full of groceries in paper bags, which are so much fun to carry up to the second floor. Uh, because apparently the, the store was out of plastic bags. So there was no plastic bags to be had. And uh, yeah, with all those perishables in my trunk, I got stuck in an amazing traffic line because somebody had an accident just outside the entrance to the apartment complex. And eventually I found my way around to get back. So in other words, not much happened. Yeah, yeah, no, not much happened. Really boring. But I don't remember why that meant that I got to bed late. Oh, that's right. I Thank you, Rast. Because I was trying to get the video recorded and produced and set up for the Great Guitar Build-Off. Because competition open the registration... Sorry, registration opened uh, February 1st, and uh, the contest runs until, uh, I think it was, I think it said either June 31st or July 31st, I, I forget which of the two, but either way, it's a date that doesn't exist, and, and a lot of people gave Ben flack for magically creating a day that didn't exist. Um, and while there are days that I would love to have one more day in the month, I'm not sure that's going to help. And I'm pretty sure I would use that extra day as poorly as I've been using the days already available to me. Uh, corners. Sorry. Corners require a little extra thought. There, that goes there. There, that goes there. And... Let go there. Yeah, that works. It's ugly, but it works. Oh, 
Hmm? Nothing. I was just thinking about something. What? About ugly and works? Mm hmm. How yeah. I know a couple people like that. <laughs> it's okay. I was thinking the same thing and wasn't going to say it, but yeah. Seriously. The zombies die in the morning fire. Nope, apparently not. Oh, where did you find that zombie in the um uh, in the other farm? I was listening to your stream on audio while at work, which is part of why I couldn't answer every time you asked, hey and on. Yeah, you know, XYZ. Because I was cleaning a cello. Or, well, no, not a cello. A viola. Or a violin. And that kind of uh, active chat. Well, he was actually inside the water path of one of the sugarcane farms. Oh. <coughs> uh, I take but it he had I an think... item in his hand? Yes, he had sugarcane in his hand. Ah. Uh. But what I think happened was that he spawned on the side of the farm and fell into the water. Oh, uh, where the sugar cane actually grows? Yes. Ah. Because when I did a light level check on that, it was like a light level seven. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I remember you mentioning. I remember hearing that you checked somewhere and found it. I just I, because I was audio only, I couldn't tell where where this was. This being where you found it. Yep. Okay. So I got to go through and and light that up, but it's not a big deal yet until we start doing our farm, our farms. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's on the agenda. I, I might actually take a little break from some of this to go work on that part too. Is this path three wide? Where am I right now? I mean, besides underground. All right, time time to go do a quick no. Time to fill this in real quick. I'm not far from the villager trading hall, because I, I hear somebody working at one of the workbenches. was it that you had a question about? You know, since I'm sitting here. Uh, I know I was asking about uh, how to turn off the light bloom in Optifine. Uh, I, uh, like, I like the light colors, but I don't like the really bright glowing halo around everything. Uh, are you sure that's not the shader pack that you're using? Because I don't, I don't have a light bloom on any of the lights, unless well, I yeah, um, when, unless I have shaders on. I don't have shaders on unless I have Optifine on. Oh, uh, because you can run Optifine without having shaders on. Right, right, but there's certain things in the shaders that I can't get on Optifine for some reason. Hmm. 
don't know. Teal. That's going to be blue and white. No, that's uh, light blue. You're asking the wrong person on the server about teal. Okay. I, I, I believe everything comes in the uh, eight box of crayons. If it's not one of the eight colors in the eight box, it's not a color. Ouch. So, Ooh. what in the world? Hmm? <clears throat> what are you what in the worlding about? Uh, all I heard was a ding, and then I saw you come flying through like an Enderman in front of me. No. I was standing there. Alright, so it's green and blue. Green and blue dye. Okay, so you guys were wanting to down on some uh well, I mean since we got everybody here. Okay, that's why that was looking weird. I was trying to figure out what was going on. This goes on a little diagonal and then uh, it goes straight. And then I need to go. This path branches off into many paths. Many, many paths. Oh, many my. Oh, lapis. Uh, lapis we can turn into blue dye. Yep. And there's a whole church full of people willing to trade for it, too. Everyone has a few levels. I just uh, got back in. A here. couple. That's all you need. The I, board. I lost. I lost the hundred and some odd levels that I had when I tested the player graves data pack. <laughs> you know, you can go from like zero to like a hundred and something in like four minutes, right? Yeah, I know. Yeah, but you have to listen to their awful noises. No, you don't. That's what mute's for. Um, before we do that, can everybody descend upon the community center for a second? Uh-oh. Descend? Descend, day send, whatever. I send, you send, we send, descend? We all send for ice cream? Ooh. Yes. Ice cream. 
it won't like me back, but I will thoroughly enjoy it. We can get you the lactose free one. Sure. Some of us like flavor, though. It's gonna be the end of me, but. <laughs> I like the design, medic. Thank you. Uh, is stuff still? Yeah, stuff still going through the storage center. Somebody's got to stay here and keep that loaded for a little bit. I know. That's why I asked everybody to send up on the community center, and no one listens to me. Surprise! What you it say? doesn't make it go any faster the more people you have here. Oh, there's that. No, but something else will go faster the more people I have. Uh oh. Do, do I dare ask what? I mean, I don't know what you dare or dare not to do. Durr. Durr. Where is it? There we go. I did bad being night, so someone should probably sleep. Uh, oh, that's right. Mending and unbreaking. I think we have two different uh, bits of music in mind now that I actually hear hear that. Uh, Mr. Mending. There we go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And unbreaking. them for some more unbreaking <coughs> alright um I need the name of a spaceship or pop culture flight reference type firefly I, I think I've already got that somebody's gonna have to check the other ones in the basement I think I've also got a set of Elytra named Yugo, so... The Galactica? Okay. I've been watching that lately again. <laughs> oh, uh, that's the Unbreaking and now... Mending. Was the Galactica a space boat? Yes. Starship. Battlestar. Space boat. Space boat. Space drama. I'll give you that much at least. Alright. I need another one. Feel free to... Uh, I think we've already got an Apollo. In, uh, Enterprise! I think we got that one too. I, I think we hit a lot of the uh, early obvious ones. Uh, you know what? Instead of saying I think, I think, I think. Let, let me go do this over there where the basement is. And I can actually take a look. And read off what we already have. So we've already got Top Gun, Apollo 11, Firefly, Dumbo, Peter Pan, Pixie Dust, X Wing, Yugo, Galactica. Uh, we got an X Wing, we need a TIE Fighter. TIE. And is it one word or two? Yeah. All right. 
so there's the unbreaking. All right, so we got us a Tie Fighter now. So, just out of curiosity, how mm -hmm. many elytras do you need? <laughs> what, what does need have to do with any of this? Oh, wait, uh, we need a mongoose. Why wing? Mongoose and mending mongoose. Yeah. What does mongoose have to do with flight? No, wasn't it the one from Stargate? No. It was somebody's craft. No. I'm Googling this. Oh, <gasps> F-302 Mongoose. Air slash space slash hyperdrive strike craft in Stargate SG-1. People remember things. Thank you very much. What were you talking about? Uh-huh. Mongoose, M-O-N-G-O-O-S-E. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. To be fair, the hyperlink part says S three hundred two, so I'm not sure if I just am randomly like my brain latched onto mongoose, and they mentioned it once in the show. So you probably make it F three hundred two mongoose. Uh, M O N well, G O O S E. F three hundred two. I remember as the interceptor. Uh, I don't know who this mongoose thing is, or what that has to do with anything. Apparently, that's what it's called. Someone must have mentioned it, and it's stuck in my brain. Ah! I need levels. Of course, I need to go trade with uh, some of those guys for a couple more Unbreaking books anyway. That's so got Unbreaking and Mending. We've got Unbreaking and Mending. We've got oh, Mending. Archangel! Need one. It's from Gundam. You wouldn't know. Hang on. I need to get three more unbreaking books first. Oh, <laughs> I didn't realize that that was going to be an unfortunate side effect. SDF one. SDF one. SDF-1. First uh, production model Mac Cross base fortress. I, You're saying words, but I have no idea. And my box of emeralds is in another box, basically, because I cleared it off to go end busting last week and totally forgot about it. Lack of knowledge, you've never seen Matt Cross? No, I have no idea what you're talking about. No, that's like, you're literally straddling the uh, age gap between us. <laughs> Wait, why, why am I... We, we got mega farms right there with tons of emeralds just waiting to be plucked. Alright, let me see if these two are enough. Oh, I need books which I put in storage no I guess I'm here one two three so need three unbreaking mending mending we need oh, yeah. I need three unbreaking three and a brain we need the other sibling for the younger part of the millennial stuff That's not young. That was. <laughs> hmm? That cross is old. So are we, honey. So are we. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, is Matt Cross the name of the show? The name of a thing in the show? The name of a category of show? Matt Cross uh, it, is the first season. It then evolved into Matt Cross Plus. And, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. And, and are we talking Matt Cross as in three letters M A C? And then like like are is this a yeah, is this no, a he, mis does, he doesn't even know what like universe you're in, hon. Is this a misspelled yeah, Macron? Like. <laughs> 
Okay. Somebody with a lisp no. asked for a Macron. <laughs> I, I I'm lost. I've no. Is, is this what it? I, I, is this what I know it's you like are. To get old? This this I, is I literally like yeah. Huh? <laughs> In my day, <laughs> you had to mine uphill both ways with a wooden pickaxe. We had no, no newfangled <laughs> enchantments either. You took all day and you enjoyed it. All right, let me, let me go to options, sounds, crank that To be that fair, off. that's fairly accurate. What? <laughs> you know, I, I mean, anyway, the, way... the thing... The thing he is referencing is anime. Okay. And well, it that, that's is... Because that's uh, a whole Matt class Cross... of thing I don't... Okay. Exactly. So think like uh, Star Trek, um, Enterprise series. Matt mm -hmm. Cross is the Enterprise part of that concept. Okay. So it is both the name of the ship and the name of the series. Until you Correct. start getting into like the next generation and exactly yes. and yes. the quest for more money and uh... exactly. <laughs> Which SD happens in anime up. just as much as it does anywhere else. Oh, why should they SDF. be any different? But the reason it's SDF one space Matt Cross is because it crash landed. We couldn't even reproduce it. We barely got the technology on it limping enough to fight off the invasion that came. <laughs> but we also come back and to also, the original question. This is Robotech for the record. M A is the, the overarching series. But, yes, uh, M A C Mac Cross. Yes. All one word. Mac C R O S S. M A C R O S S. That's yep. the one. Okay. All right. I'm breaking. Sleepy, 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 sleepy. Oh, no, not where I'm I am. I'm in a bad place. <laughs> All right. Someone who doesn't like boom, sleep. I need another one. The sleep or your stuff getting blown up. Ship. Gundam Zero One. Ooh, lollipop! The good ship lollipop? Yes! Breaking. Now sleep. Do you have one more or no? I have two more later that need to be worked on. HMS. Hang, hang on, hang on. I'm putting some tools in my hands so that way I can uh, also Ooh. get those repaired since I'm standing here collecting tons of XP. I need sleepy. Great, I, I'm in the nether. I'm not sleeping there. Alright, uh... What's another franchise? I was going to give you a real life one. <laughs> well, that, that's what I was... HMS? HMS? Queen Elizabeth. Uh, these or are flight. you would prefer... A... Yeah, flight. Through the air. Not over the water. Well, that's pretty much flight. <laughs> uh, that's a negative and ghost rider. on how fast you're going. Exactly. <laughs> Should I just name one of these ghost rider? <laughs> Goodness. But really show my age and go space ghost coast to coast. I love that shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Medic, help me out with the old references. We got two more. <laughs> that was harsh. Uh, <laughs> hey, I, 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 like, I'm right there with them, so, you know. LL12. LL12? Mm-hmm. Is that where Cool J got his name? Mm-mm. I, I'm drawing a blank on this one. I feel like I should know it, but I can't. I can't quite place it. The old dinosaur that we used to drive at work. 
<laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but it never took flight. Well, I mean, oh, there, there's a, uh, there, there's this one railroad <laughs> track in the city that if you're not really careful, you, you will be airborne for a couple of seconds. Well, with some of the old medics that were driving it, <laughs> it got airborne. Yeah, Arcadius. Why do I feel like we know some of them? I'm sure you do. Well, the two airship names from Final Fantasy Oop. Seven. Uh, I've already got it. Oh, well. <laughs> Give me a second, and, and it'll be fully mended in a minute. This, this is ridiculous. Oh, there we go. Look, look at all that XP. Bam. Done. I guess I might as well stay here and get a few more levels myself. Wait. Oh, because I already put some of them away. I was like, why do I only have five? I, kn I know we made eight new Elytra. That's, that's a lot of XP. So much XP. really want to leave, but leaving that much XP is not good for the server. Yeah, the server. That's kind of trippy. This is almost like before we started using a server and somebody made a chicken farm that would just collect chickens, collect chickens, collect chickens until the local world started, you know, slowing to a crawl. And then you do something really goofy, like throw a splash potion of harm into the cluster of said chickens. Do you, do you guys remember that? No. I can't say that I do. No, you wouldn't. This, this was before we started running on a server. Who threw a thing in a cluster of chickens? Uh, we all did, depending on who needed XP at the time. Somebody would have their, their little uh, chicken farm steadily producing chickens into a pit until uh, you, you threw a splash potion of harm, you got all the XP you needed, and it slowed everything to a crawl. I only vaguely remember that. Which one was that? That was before we started running on servers at all. Oh, like when we're at the house? Like, just in the house? Uh, even, e even before we started running a server in the house. Way, way back when it was still just whoever oh. got home from work first loaded up a world. Wow. That was a lot ago. So why do I remember that? Not what I just did, you know, a couple hours ago. I can't help you with that. You didn't finish that degree? Short term memory or something or another. Hey, look. It's a flight of wings. We could use a couple more, though. All right. Oh, that's what I meant to do. I was going to name three of them. Ickle me, pickle me, and tickle me too. Yeah, but they weren't spacefaring. They were flight. Nobody said it had to be space. They were flight. Flight. Oh, I didn't know airplanes were an option. Uh, we literally started off the list with Top Gun. I, I don't... It doesn't exist in my world. I don't like him. <laughs> what? Wow. Okay. 
I don't. I don't like him. I don't. I don't know why you're acting like this is news. Just and, and I and I love how it's not any you, like you say that as if there's only one him you could be possibly referring to that entire movie. Um. I mean, I I didn't think Iceman was that bad. I mean, Val Kilmer was a pretty good sidekick in that one. I may have done a very bad thing. Uh-oh. What did you do? Well, I asked multiple times for everybody to meet me in the town hall to help me do this before we went and played Gatan, and no one was here, so it's I not was my here. Fault. I was putting all the wings away. And I just saw a glitch with a whole bunch of unlit caves, but... That should be far enough. <laughs> okay, I like the BB-8. Even though I thought that was ver <gasps> I thought that was verboten Star Wars, but uh, I'll take it. That's good. I like that. He's so cute. Oh, that's what uh, <laughs> that's what they were counting on. Pay no attention to the story. Just look at the cute droid. Look at the. Look at the cute birds. And L look at the cute droid. The, go, droid, go. The not so cute birds the original fans are throwing at us. <laughs> He's so cute. Yeah, the only thing I could fit there that still gave. Dude, please get out of my boxes. No, that was me. You too. Well, they weren't that bad a band. I mean, they got a little, you know, pretentious towards the middle and the end. I mean, I guess technically, mm -hmm. as far as I know, they're still out, out and about uh, not touring like everybody else is not touring, but, you know. Could you say about any more Canadian? I, I've been watching a lot of Brad Angro videos. He, he does a lot of painting and finish work, and that's what I'm struggling with right now. Like, I, I've got that tele kit behind me, and honestly, just installing the hardware and putting it together probably take about an hour, maybe two. Um, what's really going to take the most amount of time is finishing it. Uh, I do plan on picking up some teak oil and shellac. I just got to find the, the same kind of shellac as what we use at work. Because I would like to try a French polish on the neck. Um, I just want to make sure that I get it pretty close to the color that we do for the violins we do a French polish on. Um, which is why I also brought some busted maple bridges. Because the neck on the telly is maple. And the bridges are maple, so I'll practice polishing on these until I get the color I want, so I'm not messing up a really nice Telecaster neck. Stripping shellac does not, uh... Of all the things I want to be doing with the guitar, redoing the same color work is not what I want to do. Is there a reason all the critter heads got moved to a separate box? Yeah, because I needed to make room for my bazillion of those things. Those things? Look what's in their place. No, up here. What, the coral? Yeah, those. Mm -hmm. Huh. Because we couldn't fit the... Wait, what? Oh, okay. No, I couldn't. Space became the final frontier. 
Yeah, but don't we have some other boxes that... Well, not that box. Well, maybe that box. No. And then? And no, and then. Anyway. So, I need to figure out... I need to figure out what I'm going to do finish-wise on the guitar. Because that's going to determine about how long it takes to put this Telecaster together. I'm going to stick to the stock parts that came in the kit this go-round. And hopefully, when I go to order the next kit, they'll have some of the extras that I wanted to do anyway. Like, um... Actually, let me, uh... Let me pull up the stats real quick. Our builds, Tele Deluxe. So, this guitar kit is from The Fretwire at thefretwire.com. And it's an all their body with a maple neck and maple fingerboard. Fingerboard, fretboard. This has frets. Fingerboards are the other stuff I work on all day. Um, <clears throat> and... It comes with some no-name Elnico humbucker pickups and a bunch of other no-name stuff that you can upgrade if you so choose at checkout. Like when you when you buy the Telecaster kit, you can check a little box, and for an extra sixty bucks, you can get uh, Switchcraft switches and jacks. You can get CTS pots, and you can get orange drop capacitors. So you can upgrade all those components to, to high-end components for an extra 60 bucks, which I highly, highly, highly recommend. Strongly recommend. As recommended as I can recommend. Because that is worth the extra 60 bucks. And it will make an amazing improvement on the guitar you end up building. Uh, it was just out of stock. Like most of the kits. Um... When you order from the Fretwire, unlike some of these other places that I've been shopping for kits, you can also sub in some different pickups when you order it. So instead of getting the cheap stock pickups, you, you can get some EMGs or you can get some other stuff that is more affordable than EMGs uh, or Seymour Duncans. <laughs> and uh, I like the affordable ones. And uh, I need help. I thought you were working on that degree. No, A, I never finished it, and B, that's not the kind of help I need right now. Where are you? You can come look. Where, where did you go? I was over here, because you said you needed I'm help over I was at the community digging. center. I do. I'm behind the community center. I'm actually technically directly behind the um, trading hall. Okay. Oh! No, go in that hole. <laughs> yeah, I did. Seriously? <laughs> um, okay. I think we found an unlit cave. No, I was digging the hole, and I ran out of torches, and I left to go get them. Oh. And I came back. Oh my! Great googly moogly. Hi! There are an awful lot of you down here. <laughs> oh, I need to catch that without the uh, background music. <laughs> what? The new! That wouldn't even fall out. No, that was just like a. I didn't have time to scream no. Ah, no. I got it. I'm I'm standing Overwatch. I got him.
There's more stuff down here. I don't have enough storage. <laughs> no, but what? you have room for all the XP. Here. Take that with you. Is it dangerous Vision, to go alone? You. It was. Oh my. Oh man. That one? Uh, I went through a lot of arrows on that one. There was many much death. I thought we were headed to the Catan board. We were. I was trying I was trying to get everybody to come here to help me dig this out, because I figured it would go faster if I had more people. Uh then why didn't you say those words? Because I asked everybody to come here and nobody came here, so I gave yes, up. Yes, because you, you, you didn't explain the rest of that, like why you wanted everybody to come hither. I shouldn't have to explain myself at this point in the server's life. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's not how that works. Anyway, let's go play Catan. Gotta go put the stuff up. <laughs> I just put a bunch of stuff into the... Oh. So take it out. That's, that's not how that works. It's, it's well, don't let Morg flow through. No, it's already... It's in. It, it's there. It's a highly oh. efficient system. <laughs> Tell the spice to not flow. And who mapped, uh, who mapped the void? Hmm? That's the... N huh? Arcadius isn't coming over. That's the oh. nether. Ah. Yeah. It, it... That it... Underneath... Oh, wait. No, that's the nether? That's okay. the nether. I thought, I thought that was the end. No, that's the roof of the nether. Huh. Yeah. It doesn't pick up any buildings, because that's exactly mm -hmm. where the, the pig thing is. Okay. So, uh, yeah, no... Interesting. Yeah, I was gonna it's kinda build squiggly. A thing there, but you know. Yeah, no, it's an interesting pattern. I'm sure if I thought long and hard I could figure out something to do with it, but <laughs> figured I'd put you, it there. You could, I, you, you could you know, put how much that, longer will the thing you take to load? I don't know. You you, you could put that as a um, computer screen somewhere and it could be my computer at work. <laughs> Your works that oh, old, or... uh, well, I had to write down my time out on a sheet because it, it decided that it couldn't figure out where the operating system was. Oh, medic's making a squiggle. A squiggle? A squiggle in the sky. Uh, isn't sky there... squiggle. Isn't there like a, a 60s or 70s folk song about that? A squiggle that in the squiggles sky. in the sky? I don't think so. Or is that something <laughs> different? I can something see polar different. bears from up here. <laughs> They're in a glass cage right over there. Again, I need help, but I, nobody I, I, comes I feel, when I call. Oh man, I need... What's the, what's the song I'm thinking of? I, I can't even... I, I can hear the tune in my head, but I can't even... Uh, you, you're not allowed to, remember? Uh, and all that. Yeah, well, that too. <laughs> yes, yes, that's my excuse. Of course I can't sing the song. Uh, it would be so good we would be copy done. struck. Hmm? It's almost done. The first light is off. Mm -hmm. The second light is off. We may go. Okay. I'll come back and finish you in a minute. Okay, it might be more than a minute. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, at this point... I mean, I, I was actually thinking of... do. I thought we were going to do some lighting, play some Catan, and then I get a chance to do one of the... Uh, one of the regular farms. <laughs> I think you forget how long Catan takes. <laughs> yeah, and I... Well, it also depends on who's playing. Oh, D 
Did you intend to have the boat with the creeper and the pillager in it? No. No. Those boats were just there. <laughs> we should probably kill him before we go down there. Yeah. Medic, you coming? Nope. That was not what I wanted. No, 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 no. Break my boat? Yeah, I didn't mean to. I just meant to break the pillager and the uh, creeper. Oh, I mean, to be honest, as long as you didn't break the uh, the rest of it, that's okay. <laughs> Much rather... A, Can a Medic hear us? Than... I don't know. Did he get kicked out of the thingy? Oh, for being too quiet for too long? No, he's in mm -hmm. challenge. Okay. He may have himself muted. Oh, no. oh, he's on, oh, he's on okay. the phone. Oh, and that was another one of the texture packs that I added just for kicks to see what it looked like. What's that? Ah! Oh, I see. Okay, that's that's <laughs> odd. That's odd. <laughs> the uh, squarular sun and moon? No. No? No? Why? Why? It looks like a... Why are you hurting things? <laughs> Ow. Okay. You probably ought to put something in those boats so we don't have a repeat of that particular performance. Well, I have a sheep in one of them because he's the one. Mm -hmm. Thinking the rest of them can probably just have villagers or something. Uh, since stuff is spawning there, obviously. I I don't. Yeah, know I didn't. That. I didn't turn around and uh, and stream the whole thing like I was originally gonna do. Oh. Yeah, I could do that. I really wanna. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> y you've got a bunch of villagers over in the over in a greenhouse for some reason. You could always just toss a couple of them in boats. They were have, supposed to be cartographers so I could get better maps and have them throw empty maps at me when I get villager or hero of the village. Oh. However, However, the cartography table didn't look as good on the floor. So that oh, I thought you were after that one arrow that you couldn't fi you couldn't manage to. Well, that's what I'm. That's what it turned into. But it was oh, supposed okay. to be the cartographers' uh, guild was what it was originally going to be. Okay. But, I was trying to figure out why you had a village by your village. Like, I heard you like villages, yeah. so I put a village in your village. Yeah, yeah there, there will be another one. As soon okay. As I figure out how I want to incorporate the uh, cartography table. Until then, though. <laughs> Just me and you playing? Uh, I, I think we're going to have to... We're waiting on Medic. I think we're going to have to reschedule this for... Uh, Two weeks since. No, oh. because it's already eight. Why? Because it's already eight thirty, and I was oh. brain dead when we started this thing. Oh, that just means you you're guaranteed to lose. That's okay. We can still play. <laughs> Thanks. Although I meant to. Uh... Oh oh oh! Mountains rendering eventually. Where is he? Nope, not that guy. Somewhere over here. The rainbow. Out there. Yo. Besides, I need to grab a. Uh, I need to grab uh, some bamboo. Oh, 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 watch out for that tree. Arzen? Oh, there's George of the Jungle, but... Same concept. And I mean, it was kind of rip offy. Well, I mean... Sometimes you gotta worry about copyright. Oh. Why? Why is there a random oh, minecart in one of these? Something break? Yes. Yes? Well, if you're asking that question, then yes, something probably broke. <laughs> I didn't do it. 
<laughs> you're you're <laughs> awfully quick. <laughs> you're awfully quick with that. I, I, just, I get blamed <laughs> for everything. Not everything. <laughs> Not everything. Everything. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to remember where he is. Which mountain was it? Oh, I think this is it. I think this is it. Yes, it's the little forgotten panda that Arcadius brought all uh, the way uh, over uh. here for rest. <laughs> She's over in the bay where she said she was going to make her zoo and her primary base and everything. And I keep asking for help, and guess who gets no help? Hmm. Like right here. I brought you two pandas, a oh. polar bear, a... <laughs> Uh, we do need a second parrot. One. Uh, how are you going to breed a parrot with just one? He doesn't need to breed it. <laughs> this isn't this isn't the ark. She doesn't need two of them. Yeah, we do. Oh, come on, float near the stupid panda. Come on, Chi Chi, pick up the stupid bamboo. This is why there are so few of you. Eat the bamboo. Eat it. I don't know if he can eat in a boat. I don't know if he can either. That's um, what I was trying to figure out. I know he does a lot of other weird things in the boat. Like he'll roll around on his back in the boat. Yeah. I'm, I'm pretty sure shoving food at him and screaming <laughs> eat it is not helpful or... Well, I mean... Well, I mean. You mean... Poke him with a... Poke him with some bamboo. There, see? He's playing on his back now. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, he's kicking in the air. Come oh. here, where are you at? I don't know where I am. I'm here. I'm in the. I'm in the. Oh, <laughs> I keep flying to the wrong bay. Way. Ah, that's the wrong. <laughs> I'm lost. I'm lost in my own world. Right there. Yeah. A bad aim. You gotta like land it in the boat. Uh, well, it, that's just it. The it won't land in the boat. It'll land next to the boat. It'll land around the boat. Oh, no, yeah, that no. just makes him happy. That just makes him happy. Now you got them all excited, and there's no other pandas. Oh, he's there. He goes. He's eating it underwater. <laughs> he's using it as a snorkel. He's not eating it. He's playing underwater. What That's is awesome. going on here? <laughs> what is going on here? Okay. Well, okay, then. <laughs> he's, he's showing you his tail. That's all it is. <laughs> that, that, that was... All right, let me just leave that there so we got more for later. <laughs> Okay, that was that was too weird for words. That was too weird for words. Hey, for somebody who gets mad about people poking around in other people's boxes. Uh, I'm getting out the resources. I need to finish one of his walls. Ah. You know, that helping thing. Uh, that felt rather pointed. What? Get it? Hmm? I don't know why. Yeah, especially since I've been helping you with this lighting project. <laughs> you volunteered. Where'd our kitties go? Nah, uh, because we're, we're nearing the end. Ah. Okay. I... I need to fi I need to figure out my life. I need to figure out where I'm going to fit a bunch of stuff because I need to finish that tree farm. I need to finish that church roof. I, I was actually half tempted to to go back to my uh, shack at the beach and start working on a little Zen pond over here because I I'd actually like to retrain this whole area to make it a little resort for the uh, shady emerald shiny emerald retirement home. Shady Emerald's a different retirement home. That's the one where you put your family that you don't like. That one doesn't have a resort. 
<laughs> no, that one does not ha Well, I mean, it has a resort in the brochures. Nobody said that the sand and the water that your uh, loved one would be sitting next to is in a lunch pail. But no, I, I was going to re-terrain the bottom of this, a nice sandy beachfront, you know, extend the beach out a little bit. Uh, see if I could bribe Medic into setting up a beach scene. Maybe put a nice little pretty waterfall right over there. Um, <laughs> yeah, a kiddie pool. I was thinking a little a little beach bucket full of water, you know, a little beach bucket full of sand. Yeah, maybe get a waterfall coming right out there. Nice little scenic waterfall going into here. A couple of stones, a lot of sand. Get some, you know, beaches and umbrellas. Some umbrella drinks. I don't know how you make that, but... And then eventually figure out the resort. Because I kind of figured this area would be the back of the resort. That direction would be the front of the resort. And I don't know. I hadn't figured out too much beyond that. Hello, doggies. I need to name all of you. I need dog names. Anybody watching this later on YouTube, leave in the comments names, suggested names for the dogs. I know it's nighttime. I should be able to sleep. There we go. I need to clear out this because we don't need that tree farm anymore. That's uh, just temporary. I may have to rehome my turtles. Do I have enough eggs to rehome my turtles? Yeah, I got enough eggs to rehome the turtles. I need some more turtle eggs, though. I shouldn't have said that with Rayaston. She'll be asking why. Why? Why what? Why do you need more turtle eggs? Because I need more turtle eggs. This was where Arcadius was digging. So I had his stream on audio too. And all I heard was, okay kids, this is what not to do. Don't dig straight down. Oh. <laughs> oh. And I need to I need to recount how tall those windows are so I can make those windows the same height. And, and may maybe then people will stop looking at them and going, oh no. I don't know what I'm going to do in the front, though. I'll have to figure that out, too. Probably figure out the roof, too. Yeah. No, I got an idea. I saw something that looks like it might be a good idea or the start of a good idea. I just need to actually try it out and see if it'll work. Medic, it doesn't feel like this zigzag is ever going to end. It does feel like it's going to end. I keep looking up and the roof doesn't look any closer. Oh, I didn't realize that uh, that had been glassed in. I don't know what he was nodding. I'm waiting to see if he typed something. I don't know if he can type and talk at the same time. Um, as someone who struggles to talk without the typing. And talk at the same time? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am not exactly one to be throwing stones on that one. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is the build that never ends. Okay. Why did things just happen to my face? I don't know. What things? And why is there a random stick in my face? Um. Like a post. It's just like chilling here. 
Where is here? Where are you? I'm glassing in Medic's house place thing. Oh, okay. So you've been working on putting the glass. That is the ugliest farm. But it is nice. It works out pretty well. Uh, and we can move it if it needs to be moved. I, I think I mentioned that earlier, but... Just to make sure it is very expressly stated, that farm can move somewhere else if it needs to. Which farm? The Phantom Farm at the top of the world. Uh, Medic said something earlier about not wanting to move it. <laughs> no, it's uh, a... <laughs> I love my totems. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, they they have come in handy. I uh, I. I forgot when I updated that the whole reason I can see the Hoglin farm from the AFK spot in the Hoglin farm is because I have Optifine and Fog turned off. So when I went to go land, I apparently... Um, I, move, I moved in a downward fashion a little no, too no, fast. No, 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 I have to get back up there. I, no! <laughs> Medic! I have to get back up there. <laughs> no. Okay. Oop. This is looking nice, though. And I think Medic said something about trying to put an elevator or something in. I'm at the top now. <gasps> no, no, not, no, not, no, not. Bad things happened. <laughs> what bad things happened? I fell. Oh. Uh, I need to get the uh, purper farm going too. Because we got the farm for the coarse flowers. I just need the actual farm for the plants themselves. Because once we start getting the coarse fruits from a proper purple farm, we can get a blaze farm going. <gasps> watering trader, watering trader, watering trader. Uh, oh, he's down here at the base of the tower. What's he got? He's got a medic head that actually works. Unless I buy it and then it doesn't. Why does that player head work and not the other one? Huh. Imponderables. Uh, he's got some mossy cobblestone. Uh, ender chest. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold it on. Medic, I'm done with it. In case you're wondering, people, this is part Welcome. of a uh, wandering. Th this is part of a data pack from Vanilla Tweaks for the Wandering Trader. I added the code to add the uh, one to three random heads from people on the server. Yeah, those are that's that's an old Arcadia head too. I wonder why these are showing up this way and not the other. Hmm, imponderables for another time. Uh, we're good on purple dye, right? Yeah. And magenta. Okay, start at the top. All right. Uh, red mushroom block. Red mushroom block. Got mm -hmm. it. Stone okay. bricks. Those in the oh, we did okay. Mm -hmm. We should have stone plenty brick. of stone bricks. A crafting table. We don't, but okay. Next. A crafting table. 
Oh, I thought you were being sarcastic. Okay. No. He's offering a mini crafting table. Cute. Is that for small jobs? Okay. Mm, next. Crimson planks. Okay. Furnace. Ooh, cute. Furnace, okay. Polished diorite. Hmm. Mm-hmm. What? An ender chest. I can see your screen. I know, I know. I, the lodestone, it, please. Do, oh, do you know how expensive that is? That's a netherite ingot just to make a lodestone. Plus a whole bunch of other stuff. Well, I don't know how to... Oh, wait, we have one. How do you make a lodestone? Please don't. Please. Either I'm taking this one or telling me how to make one. <laughs> how about neither? I'll, I'll take false options for 300, Alex. You can get an ender chest and some mossy cobblestone. Actually, I got the ender chest. I don't have the emeralds, but I got the ender chest. I have an ender chest, I have mossy cobblestone, but I need to know how to make a lodestone. No, you don't. No, seriously. That that that's not that's not a cheap like Somebody used them as decorating blocks for that little villager thing over in the corner there. Someone who is not currently logged it's in. It's chiseled stone bricks and one netherite ingot. It's the netherite ingot. For serious. All right, where is he? He was over at the base of the tower. Come to me, dude. Uh, on your left. Hello? He was in that direction. How far, how far could he have wandered? He was literally right here. Well, wandering is literally in his name. Why does he only have one llama? Uh, it depends on where he spawned. The, the other llama could actually be stuck on a ledge, or the lead could have broken. Medic, do you want me to get you real your heads? I, I'd say go ahead and grab them anyway, if, if it works. Although he had two llamas a minute ago. Ow. Oh. Oh, for serious. Oh, that's right. I turned all my game noises off for uh, because I was over at the zombie pigman farm. Do we need any buckets of tropical fish? I don't think so. And it's not like uh, we don't have an ocean right there to get buckets of tropical fish if we need them. Okay. I got all the things. You have one thing left to give us, dude. Oh, uh, <laughs> that's right. I forgot that was another one that I was uh, playing with for resource packs. It's one that turns the leather the same brown as the leather items you craft. I don't know hmm. how I like that. BRB. And I think 
it got rid of the weird stripe unless you dyed it in the same resource pack. Where would I put leads? Ah. Gunpowder is supposed to be running something, right? There we go. And arrows. We never did collect a lot of arrows. I'm kind of surprised. I expected more than that. Last season, we had more arrows than we knew it to do with, but we also had. Um. Some farm, I don't remember which one that was producing an excessive amount of them. We did finally find the skeleton spawner that was in the area. But, um... Nobody's... Oh! That, that is also on my agenda, to make a, uh... Skeleton spawner farm for the bones and arrows. And bows. Because bows come in handy for making dispensers. And we, we almost always need... Dispensers. I mean, we can we we have all the materials to craft the bows to make the dispensers, but why why go through all that work when somebody will kindly give them to you? All right, I've hit the the end of the end of everything, the end of all things. No, not the end of all things. So uh, this is where. Oh. Got a new keyboard. My five keys in a different place. So this is where I'm going to go over to the credits and say thank you very much for joining. I hope you had fun. We do this every Tuesday at 6.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern. And on Fridays, I do another stream at the same time, 6.30. And it's called Games Revisited, where I take a look back at some classic games and we're currently playing through Knights of the Old Republic 2, The Sith Lords. I think for the next game after that, I'm going to go back to the old classic NES and play Crystallis. That should be a short run through that. Um, I remember it as taking longer, but when playing it in some downtime, I, I realized that y you do kind of progress pretty quick. So, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. How, of course, that's what I said about Illusion of Guy, and that took a lot longer than I expected to. Um, so, who knows? Anyway, that, that seems to be the, the roadmap on that. Hopefully next week, uh, when Tuesday rolls around, I'll, I'll have a, uh, a better sense of everything that's going to go on with this. And keep an eye out on the YouTube channel. If you haven't already, go subscribe. I've got the Great Guitar Build-Off initial post that went up last night. And I'm going to start, hopefully this weekend, recording the Telecaster build that I've been talking about on and off throughout today's stream. Um, that is not part of the Great Guitar Build-Off. It is what I'm hoping to be able to flip for money for a better quality kit for the Great Guitar Build-Off. That sounds more wrong than I expected it. It's not that the Telecaster kit's a bad kit. I just, I, I'm looking for something a little different for that. Remind me, I'll, I'll clarify later when I stream next. And if you follow me on Twitch, you'll know when I stream next, because you'll get the notification if Twitch is behaving properly. <sighs> okay, thank you, have fun, and uh, I'll see you next time.